xenograph. Xenograph. It means cow bone or horse bone. Oh, okay. Horse bone is called sequestered uh, bone or bovine bone for cow. Mm. If you use the cow bone, the body cannot remodel that. So it will stay there forever. Oh my god. What? Yeah, they are not... The cow bone what other Bios or xeno, xeno or I mean xenograft means the bone from another species. Now what's available to us right now is bovine which is cow and sequestrin which is horse. So which one do you I use bioos which is bovine. Bovine. See in the beginning when they came and suggested, recommended the BIOS for, as a bone graft material. The disadvantage of it was mentioned as being still in there even if it, after a year when you revisit the area. Yeah. That was a disadvantage. Mm -hmm. But now we learn, okay, that we can use as an advantage. Now if you have only BIOS there, then you will have natural bone little bit in between it and full of bio granulation of the granular nature of the bios. And that's not necessarily very good bone, even though I have implant that's been in pure IOS, bios for like 20 years and it's still working. But ideally nowadays is to mix the bios with a allograft, which is the same species. So the allograft, the body will remove and put its own bone there but enough xenograft is there that it cannot resorb and the, for the mass not to be lost. So you, so you mix them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So again, over the years, we have learned all this. In the beginning, they said, oh, buy off. That's bone graft. Sure. Nice. We used it. And then we noticed six months later, we went in there. Damn thing is still there. There's no bone. A year later, damn thing is still there. Still not good bone. So it was not good for pure bone graft. But then we used only allograft. We noticed you have beautiful bone in two months, three months, but then like these instances that you mentioned, go there a year later, the whole thing remodeled. Or we put it in the space between the implant and the buccal cortical bone of the centrals. It'll go back, it'll go down. Allograft will get totally remodeled, yeah. But you put xenograft there, then it'll last. So now the best combination is mix half and half, and then in instances that you, space maintenance is more important, put more bios. In instances that you want to go back and put an implant in there, then put more allograft. Because the xenograft is going to be a chunk of xenograft there even, well, yeah, for a long time. I don't know forever, but at least for a year when you go back there, it's still there. Now, what I just told you is very, very valuable. It's a, very, it's a result of a lot of observation that how to play with these bone graphs to get the desired effect.